to a sports factor. Joining us now is a chairperson of Synchro Stars, Jamaica, Diane Campbell. Diane, good evening. Thanks for stopping by. My pleasure. Yes. Um, synchronized swimming. Beautiful to watch. Absolutely wonderful. Worse when it gets to the Olympic level. It just takes the breath away. Um, do we have those kind of people here in Jamaica? We have the foundation to get us there. And uh, <laughs> we're starting with CC Camp this year, 2011 Puerto Rico. And I'm very proud to say that even though we have a small team of only two girls, Jada Harrison and Brian Campbell, they are two vivacious, vibrant athletes that are wanting to go to the next level. And I think we have a chance. Mm -hmm. That's CC Camp is, is going to be in Puerto Rico. In Puerto Rico, yes. Mm -hmm. um, you, you, let's get straight to it because this is one of the most important aspect of sending teams, of course, funding, um, you, you require 500 and what? 504,000. dollars Right, and we already have 204,000, so we're short 300,000, but as a Jamaican, I don't think mm -hmm. synchronized swimming and any other sport should let money stop them from doing what they have to achieve. Mm -hmm. Look at Bob Sled. Right. So what we're doing, we're going ahead, pushing ahead, and, and getting things done. We've had help. Sports Development Foundation came, mm -hmm. Grace Kennedy came, Jamaica Energy Partners came, and we have private entities and private individuals helping us, and this is what we need to go to Puerto Rico, and we're getting there. Mm -hmm. the, the 204 that you have, you have that in hand? In hand. Nothing promised outside of this? Um, promises are still being entertained, and we're listening to them, and mm -hmm. with coming here with you, talking to you, I know mm -hmm. that other persons will hear our plight and wanting to help. So feel free to call ACG mm -hmm. yes. or Dan Campbell. So we will ask you to leave the number in a little while, but how yes. many people going in addition we, to the two competitors? The two competitors, Jada Harrison mm -hmm. and Brian Campbell. We have a judge, myself, Dan mm -hmm. Campbell, and we have national coach, Catherine Carey Reynolds. Mm -hmm. So that's four people in, four in, persons all, all in people the going to the, to the championships. But why two people? Why two persons? Well, mm -hmm. number one, we have a very strict guideline of who can qualify mm -hmm. for the sport which is the first time we've upgraded it this way. Mm -hmm. Four persons actually... Is that actually because you have a bit more competition now why you've gone that route? Not only competition, but standards. Mm -hmm. Okay. We must push our swimmers to the standard that they can actually do well in whatever field or wherever... And not just go there to compete. Not just go there to profile mm -hmm. and look cute. Mm -hmm. We need persons who can go there and perform, hold their own, don't get lost in the crowd, and make a statement that Jamaica is here, Jamaica is competent, You're Jamaica can do this. Mm -hmm. So with that, no, we had trials. It's the first time we've had trials. Mm -hmm. um, trials started in 2008, sad to say. 2008. And the sport has been around for over 12 years, so mm -hmm. that shows you that we're stepping up. Yes. But then again, somebody would say if you're stepping up, the sport has been here since for, for 12 years now, yet you only have two clubs. Two clubs, because guess what? And the it second is, one just came on recently. In 2009. What happened is that you have to have a passion for the sport. Mm -hmm. You have to have a drive. You have to have the determination to A, put, invest, mm -hmm. invest in a coach, invest in venues, in, invest in equipment, and then mm -hmm. in legal encourage the athletes to join. Initially, if you're going to be a novice, which is the first tier of synchronized swimming, it's quite easy. It's a lot mm -hmm. of fun. Then you go to intermediate. But when you get to age group level, That's you're talking about morning training from 5 o'clock to 6.30 and then go to school mm -hmm. and then afternoon training. They have cross training. They have you have to do the 5K runs. You have to do the, the football movements and the netball movements. Oh, so all to get a part of an age group standard swimmer. And remember, if you're going to compete against somebody who trains eight hours a day, mm -hmm. this is your game plan. Yeah. What's the level of um, interest from competitors? Do you find new people coming in all the time? New people coming in all the time, asking questions, parents calling. Mm -hmm. Can my child, can my son... Is my child too early, too young to start this sport? And we're mm -hmm. telling them it's one of those sports that you can actually represent your country as young as five. Mm -hmm. The question is, do you have what it takes yes. to take it to the level from novice to intermediate to so age group? Mm -hmm. And with that comes the fact that you have to have the commitment of the parents. Mm -hmm. Somebody has to take this child to the pool. Somebody has to take them to training. Somebody has to provide the infrastructure, the proper meal plan. Mm -hmm. the dedication to help them with school, to have the balance. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's, a, it's a whole village that raises a synchronized swimmer. Mm -hmm. And we're slowly understanding, appreciating, and making it happen. Mm -hmm. you, you were telling me about um, some fundraising efforts that you either put on or planning to put on. Well, what we did, we decided to have a fundraiser, a raffle. Mm -hmm. A particular hotel gave us a 
room, a weekend for two. Another company gave us a wine basket. Couples, couples Nigrill. Couples Nigrill. This is how they're going to help you. Yeah, couples Nigrill, man. Yeah came on board, gave us a weekend for two-way raffles. Mm -hmm. From the funds, we were able to help the swimmers to go. Jamaica Energy Partners heard our plight, mm -hmm. said, let us help you. Mm -hmm. um, so Sports Development Foundation. Mm -hmm. Sports Development Foundation not only gave us sufficient funds, mm -hmm. they helped us bring in a sound system. Mm -hmm. They gave us the idea that we need to create this development plan to take the next to the next level. Mm -hmm. so and they've guided us to who we were to go to to help. Mm -hmm. Minister Grange yeah. talked to us, guided us, invited us to different venues where we can meet and greet. Mm -hmm. So yes, persons wanting to help. So did they give you this individual, uh, did they give you separate and apart from the subvention that they give to the swimming association? Because you fall under that umbrella. Yes, right? they so gave, they they gave, gave separately. Oh. Because what we did, we presented what synchronized swimming needs to get to the next level. So it's not a part of the budget for swimming gymnastics? It is a part of the budget, but we, just don't, get, budget. But we just don't get any. Oh, oh so really? we have to go out and seek. Let us be honest. But, but, then, but, but then why are you a part of this, this Swim Jamaica? Uh, when it's called Jamaica? life. I know, but... It's called life, and guess what? what you it? have to live it, but you have to move on from it. And, we're, and we're not one. We synchronized swimmers are not one to dwell. We go out and make it happen. But why you don't get it? It comes in for Swim Jamaica, of which you're a part. Right. Now, why don't you get a part of it? It's I'll going tell to be you what broken down. Swim Jamaica gets the money, mm -hmm. and they have the different um, categories. Synchronized will get this, that will get that. Why you don't get any? Well, let me break it down for you. Amateur Swimming Association gets the money. Swim Jamaica is a separate mm -hmm. part. Mm -hmm. So, Amateur Swimming Association and which gets the money. which of the you operate under? I fall under ASAG. Mm -hmm. The money is given to ASAG to run the pool the administrative cost to operate a swimming program. Also, the money shared up according to how vibrant and feasible you are. Over the past five, seven years, the sport of synchronized swimming has not been that vibrant. Mm -hmm. So the money was directed and has been directed to competitive swimming. Yes. Over the past two years now. You've become vibrant. We've become vibrant. Yes. Our voices are now being heard. And things are starting to and change? Started to change. But oh. we can't wait so until ACG catches up with what synchronized swimmers are doing. Mm -hmm. We have to go oh, to and look here. So thing. what we did now, okay. we ourselves as a body went to ACG, mm -hmm. uh, went to SAG, yeah, sorry, and spoke to them. We went to Minister Grange and spoke to her, explained to her what our plights are, what we are doing to help ourselves. And from that now, doors are opening up. We well, they need to just continue be... this then. Who knows? No, but we must respect our no, federation. I know, you know, I know. I know. Right. But as you rightly say, yeah. until they catch up with you, until they you catch just up. have to go out and do your thing. And the point is that we now need to get medals. In the past, we have not gotten anything because mm -hmm. our program was not up to par. Mm -hmm. Our judging system wasn't up to power. It's just now we're revamping everything and mm -hmm. getting it right. So what we're doing now is taking a holistic approach to the sport, from the development, the grassroots level, to A, who, mm -hmm. who sanctions you, B, who judges you. And from that now, we are getting there. Are you serious about this? Oh, we have to be. Yes. You, you sound like the public relations officer as opposed to the VP. But l l let me ask you, it's, it's key that you have representation in Puerto Rico because Jamaica is hosting the Carifta Games right. next year as well. Yes, we're hosting 2012. Mm -hmm. The disciplines have been split up. Water oh. polo and synchronized swimming will be held in Jamaica. Go Jamaica. And competitive swimming is being held in Barbados. Bahamas, sorry. Mm -hmm. So what has happened is that now, by going to CC can in Puerto Rico, mm -hmm. we're letting them know that Jamaica is ready to host oh, these two disciplines in Jamaica. In Come on over. Okay. Um, this year, Carifta was held in Barbados. Due to lack of interest, CC um, synchronized swimming was dropped. So over a year, yeah. what should have started with Carifta? Mm -hmm. 26. Didn't start with 26, but guess what? That didn't stop us. Cinco Stars Jamaica went to California and did an excellent show at a meet. Island Aquatics went to California as well and did an excellent show. Talking about not letting anything get not in your way. Not letting because guess what? The athletes deserve the best. Whether the federation, the organization, the country can afford, the athletes have worked. Imagine a child gets up at 5 o'clock or 4.45, 4.30 to that matter, goes to the pool, swims for two hours, then gets up and go to school and sit and do GSAT classes. Yeah, we have athletes who are going to miss their school leaving exactly. ceremony because of the national, they're representing their national country. Team. So it's called pride, pride of self. 
pride for country. And I think three hundred thousand dollars is not too much to ask. No, you're going to get that. drop ten thousand no, dollars each. That. With, I mean, that's not a foregone conclusion. You're on CVM. That, that's that's it. Love the determination. Love the fire in the belly that here you're displaying. We're hungry. With you, I, I'm I, passionate. They're gonna get. They're gonna get to where they want to with 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 you there. I like what I'm hearing from you. All right. And thanks for stopping by. It's my All pleasure. As soon as you get the three hundred thousand next week, call us and let us know. All right, then that's All my right? plan. Thanks for stopping by. All the pleasure. best to you. Dan Campbell. Wow. Oh, 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 wow. We've come to the end of another sports chapter on behalf of producer Winston Casanova and other members of the production team and our refreshment sponsor, Mothers, the great Jamaican patty company. My name is Wayne Walker, inviting you to join us again next Tuesday for another edition of Sports Factor. Till then, pleasant viewing.